Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Let's start with the news today. Missouri U.S. Senate candidate Crichton's accused by ex-wife of domestic violence. March 21st, a writer, the ex-wife of Eric Crichton of former Missouri governor now smarting around for U.S. Senate accused the candidate in court paper made uh, public on Monday of physical violence toward her and the couple's sons. Grydens responded by posting a statement to Twitter, calling Sheena Grydens' accusations lies pedal by political operatives and the media. I'll continue to love and care for my beautiful sons with all of my being, and that includes fighting for the truth and against completely fabricated, baseless allegations, Eric Reitens, a 47 years old Republican, said in a statement. I am seeking full custody of my sons and for their sake, I will continue to pray for their mother and hope she gets uh, the help that she needs, he said, the couple divorced in 2020. Tina Crichton said in court document Dyer uh, as part of the couple child's custody proceeding that during an argument at their home in 2018, Eric Crichton knocked her down and confiscated her phone, wallet and keys. She said that Eric Crichton, who kept the firearms hidden in the house, took a photo that invaded her privacy and threatened to kill himself unless she support him publicly during a separate political scandal. She now Crichton said that her uh, then husband once covered their three years old son. In November of 2019, one of her sons came home from a visit with his father with a swollen face, bleeding gums and a loose tooth. To she said and told her that his uh, father had uh, struck him. Several candidates seeking a Republican nomination for the U.S. Senate again Crichton called for him to drop out. They were joined by Sam Charles jo Hawley, Republicans from Missouri. If you hit a woman or child, you belong in Hancock, not the United States Senate. It's time for Eric Crichton to leave this race, Hawley said on Twitter. Eric Crichton was elected governor of Missouri in 2017, but resigned in June 2018 as he faced accusations of sexual misconduct. The couple split up in 2018 after the resignation. This is the end of our news today. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.